Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm James and this is going to be a lovely video on the banded comb and how you make it. So basically, why do you even use a banded comb? We'd use these with hand stripping spaniels and setters because as soon as a blade hits a setter or a spaniel coat, it can completely affect how that coat grows back and come back fluffy. So if some dog groomers are saying, oh, well, I'll do a scissor cut because it won't affect the coat. Load of rubbish. You don't want to use a stripping knife. You don't want to use scissors like to the body because it will just completely affect how the coat grows back. So when we're hand stripping spaniels and silky coated dogs, we use a banded comb. So I'm going to show you exactly how I make one. So I've got my comb and I've got my rubber band. You want the, the band to be just a little bit longer than the amount of comb you've got because you're going to weave in and out the whole thing. This is the band is split, but that doesn't matter. And uh, if you've got any broken rubber bands on about, there you are, perfect use of them. And what we're going to do is with one side of it, we're going to weave in and out of the teeth. All the way down with a little X on this little knife. Let me show you that. So you can see how that looks there. You just work the whole way through the band. So now, I've done one side of it. Can you see? Yeah. I've done one side of it. I'm going to do the other side, but in the opposite way, slightly above. So I'm going to need to pull these down slightly so there's enough room. It doesn't matter that these aren't at the base of the comb yet, because we'll do that at the end, because otherwise there's not enough room to manoeuvre. So now I'm just going to do the complete opposite weave to what I've just done with the other length. Now you can see I've come all the way down my band. I'm now going to push this all the way back down to the base there. And this can be a little bit of a fiddly job, but just work your way along and it will get down. banded comb, banded, and what you can do with this, if you've got enough band left over you can wrap it round in or whatever, but it doesn't particularly matter, I'll just tie it on the back of it, and then I'll give you an example of how it will work. So I've got my glamorous assistant Poppy here, and you're going to show us how it works. So she's actually clipped, however I can do it on her ears because they're never been clipped. 
So she just you literally just brush through and look. That's all dead. All that coat there. So that's what you'll find. Pulls out really nicely. Doesn't hurt. And it gets rid of all that dead coat. You darling. So that is how we use a banded coat and how we make one. If you have enjoyed this, please like, please subscribe because that will really support me and I'll love you forever. And so will Poppy.